Hello everyone, welcome to Digital Charcuterie. This is James. Please give us a like and a subscribe and a big shout out to all of our recent subscribers. Thank you so, so much. It really means a lot to us all, to us here. Let's get right into it. Morbius, I saw Morbius. If you haven't seen my review, check it out. I actually, look, I kind of liked it. It wasn't great. It wasn't terrible. But somewhere in there, it's like, I said it's like a six out of 10. I stand by that. I don't really grade movies, but I enjoy, I wasn't bored during Morbius. We got to talk about it because it's, I'm not the only one. Look, I'm not the only one. If you actually go by Rod and Tomatoes right now, critics are just desecrating this film at 16% currently. Audience score, however, 64%, 6 out of 10, just like I said. This is how it is. You go into this movie, it's an hour and like, uh, it's an hour and 40 minutes, an hour and a half with credits. It's really short. It flies by. There's not a lot of substance to it. And you go, oh, that was, um, that could have been a lot worse. That's, I mean, that's as good as a point as you can make about Morbius, the film Morbius, which again, I mean, I look, when it comes on sale for $5.99, buying it and I'll watch it again. I promise you that. I'm going to watch Venom, but there'll be Carnage, Morbius, one, two, three, bam, bam, bam. I have no shame however people might be hate watching this everybody I, I don't know who's going to see it this is going to be the nickelback of movies thursday night previews it made 5.7 million dollars there was five people i'm not an exaggeration five people including me in my theater we were all in the same row not together but all in the same row five people and it made 5.7 million dollars that's 0.2 million shy of shazam and it's currently on track to make according to Variety $40 million, which would put it $7 million above Birds of Prey's opening. Birds of Prey, you know, what I say, think what you want of it, say what you want of it. I mean, and then, you know, COVID hit, the pandemic, all that, but whatever. But I mean, that's, the, I mean, it's a box office number for a movie. And both of those movies, maybe looking at them from trailer, based on trailer and based on what came before and whatnot, and track records with Sony and with DC, Suicide Squad, maybe you go, mm, you know, seven, like $40 million. People are going to go see Morbius. There's something about this movie you know, everyone's like, well, superhero fatigue. I just said it earlier today. And then you look at these numbers and say, no, there's no such thing as superhero fatigue. I mean, there will be eventually, but it's not right now because people went out on a Thursday to watch a movie that was getting desecrated by critics that had the end credit scene boiled by the director. They sounded god awful. We still said, you know what? I got to go see this for myself when we walked in. So whether it's hate watching or just intrigue in general, people are going to go see Morbius. Now, whether or not that holds up for the entire weekend, that remains to be seen. But as of right Right now, Morbius is a modest success for Sony. The movie only got $75 million to make. They don't have to earn that much back. They're on track right now. If they hit 33 to 40 million opening weekend, that's not bad. If they can get to 100, 120 million, 200 million, 250 would be a rousing success for this movie. All they have to do is get there. Competition's light. You got Doctor Strange. You might even, they might even hit a wave, a tidal wave with Moon Knight's success, followed by the anticipation of Doctor Strange. You might, they might ride that wave and get even more money than they should. But we don't know. That all remains to be seen. I'm going to leave it at that right now. Somehow, Morbius is doing okay at the box office. The audiences are liking it. Critics are hating it. But critics, can, they can take a hike. They don't know what the hell they're talking about. We, you know, you know what I'm talking about. There have been scores in the past that prove my point. So let's, everybody needs that. Everybody needs to have that one little sound bite, that one little blurb that makes them stand out and you know everyone's so narcissistic nowadays speaking of narcissistic i'm out of here all right everybody thank you so much for watching please give us a like and a subscribe share this if you want leave us a comment down below about morbius your thoughts on morbius or if you're going to see it or not and until next time may you be the master of your own universe